Hello pilots, welcome back to Motion RC. I'm James and we're out here with another V4 Flywing RC helicopter. This is the ready to fly Bell 206 and it comes out of the box exactly as you see it. It's in the Los Angeles Fire Department scheme. Looks absolutely phenomenal. The only thing you gotta do out of the box is install the blades, put the bat, charge the battery up. It comes with a charger, comes with the battery get it in there and you're ready to go. You're gonna need four AA batteries for the transmitter um, and then flying it around, it's absolutely uh, a beauty to fly. We got a nice sunny day here so you can see it there against the blue sky. Looks so good with the red, the black and the white. Um, absolutely beautiful and if anybody, if you've never flown a GPS stabilized helicopter, um, maybe you might be used to like flying uh, you might have flown one of the DJI quadcopters back in the day, maybe like the Inspire or um, the Phantom 2. It flies very much like those, which makes it nice and easy and uh, beginner friendly. I will say that these are beginner friendly, but obviously don't let the comfort and the ease of flight, uh, you know, sway you from the fact that this is a 450 heli. It's a, it's, you know, it's a, it's a scary machine. You don't want to, uh, you know, don't be dangerous with it, but obviously in the air, it looks beautiful. I really love the GPS stabilized helis being put in these scale bodies nowadays. Um, it really makes wanting, you know, a lot of guys who might've wanted to fly a scale heli, uh, you know, it gives you that ease to get into, you know, really lowered the play, uh, leveled the playing field as far as ease of access. I always felt like flying RC heli is one of the harder RC niches to get into. Flying an RC heli, um, normally, you know, the normal way you fly them is not easy. It takes time to get into, a lot can go wrong. Obviously helis, they don't glide, so if you have an issue in the air, Good luck, um, but you know, it's nice to have these GPS stabilized helis. Now when you're in the air too, the beauty about the GPS stabilization, you do have some options. So they have what's called the circle option. The nose will point forward on the heli and it'll just circle around on its own. You have the figure eight, it'll do like some of the other flywing helis uh, do. You can put this in 3D mode and it'll then fly like a normal heli. So guys who have flown helis or want this to fly it like that, by all means, power to you. I, I never put it in that mode. I'm not going to try because I enjoy the, uh, the GPS flight. Makes it nice and easy for me. And then you got the home button on the transmitter as well. So when you flick the switch, uh, this heli is going to go right. It's going to fly up to about 30 meters. It's going to hover right over the, the spot where you plugged it in and armed it to begin with. It'll, it'll position itself into the same position that you took off from and it'll automatically land. Uh, and then at that point, it disarms, shuts off the throttle. So even if you move the sticks while it's down there, you have to rearm it uh, if you want to continue to fly. So all around though, absolutely beautiful. Excited to have this and the UE, uh, the V4s uh, on the website now. So uh, if you want to take a look at this, click the link down below. Um, as far as getting inside this heli, I want to show you quick. There is a latch on the front. You just pull that latch back and it's like a little pin that goes through and then the whole uh, canopy comes off and you can see inside, you got your 3S, 4, uh, 3000 milliamp 4S pack, sorry, 4S 3000 uh, inside. And you see your GPS, all your receiver, everything's already connected. The only thing, again, you do out of the box is install the blades. And with the blades, you just want to tighten them down to the point where they will remain like this if you hold it sideways, but you should be able to just nudge it a little bit and the blade will move. You know, you never want them fully tight. You want to have play there. So uh, just remember that when, and, and the manual does a good job of explaining that as well. But all around, super cool. Just pop this right back on, make sure it's in pull the latch down, latch it back, and you're good to go for a flight. But all around, anyone looking for scale helis that are easy to fly, ready to fly, look no further than these, man. They are absolutely awesome. So guys, you got any questions, leave them down below. Thank you so much for watching our YouTube channel. We're approaching 100,000 subscribers. So if you could, if you like the content, please click that subscribe button. And uh, as always, guys, thank you for shopping at Motion RC. Bye, guys.